Hello, 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 everyone. Welcome one, welcome all. Welcome to some Saturday Night Live. Hope you guys have had a uh, good time so far. Great weekend. So we're about to make it just a little bit better, shall we? To say hello to everyone in chat as we are just getting started here. Hello, how are you guys doing today? So today we're going to be playing some backpack battles. Nice game that we've popped on every so often. Got some new content drops. I actually got it a couple weeks ago now, but checking it out today. At least returning to it. It's a uh, auto battler. Makes me happy. Got a lot to learn. A lot to relearn, I should say. Looking forward to seeing how that's uh, how it's gonna work out this time. Hello, hello. <laughs> you got some uh, gigabit fiber internet installed. To yeah. It's uh, I've had it before. It's great. Comes highly recommended. Very, very much so. Alrighty then. Looks like everything's all stable, so let's jump into it, shall we? I'm gonna start out with I don't know. Let's start out with something somewhat familiar before jumping into, into the new stuff. Uh, we have the the two classes that were here last time, Ranger and Reaper, and we have two new classes, Pyromancer and Berserker, both of which seem incredibly powerful. Uh, let's do it. Alrighty then, I'll grab you, and grab you, and grab you, just generally over here, please. Reroll, uh, let's not do Box of Riches just yet. Probably want a broom, though. Um, no, we're going Pan. Hmm. So we need food to start, I think. Grab this because it's free. And then, hello. Well, this now, this is now a decision. What to do? I'd like to grab this. Space is giving necessary. We'll get this out the gate and reserve this as well. We're kind of out of money, and I think two regeneration is better than. I'm not sure actually how this works out. I'm really not sure how this works out actually. Okay. Let's roll with this for now. <laughs> Hello there, Dorkoys. Welcome in. Have fun? I shall. I shall. Sleep well out there, man. I'll see you later. Uh, double short sword. Does a lot of damage, but takes a lot of stamina. Alright, then in that case, I'll grab you, 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 and the roll for none of this. And one another banana? Not really. Let's do it. Hello there, werewolf in a top hat. Welcome in. How are you doing today? Man's already got some dragon scale armor. Okay. Intense. Zerker Rage. Just chilling today? Yes! Well, we're go jumping back into some uh, backpack battles, which is a great game. Checking out some lots of new content here. We win this one. Poison Together Strong. Ooh, hello. Well, that's awesome. So we'll grab this, this, and this. This can go just off anywhere. Set this guy here, this specifically. It 
That's about all we're gonna get out of it, isn't it? Yeah. More foods, not particularly. Uh, reserve that, that's important for later. Wouldn't mind reserving some more space, but I think we'll... Yeah, sure. Reserve it. <coughs> We're gonna need it soon. There's so much stuff to, uh, so much stuff to go over. I don't want to start explaining most of my mindset and logic behind, or my thought process behind why I'm selecting items and such. And the reason for that is I'm not super experienced anymore. Um, so I'm being a little bit more careful around these things. Let's see, can I get an extra item in here? I think I can. If I do it like this. There we go. Not really. Hmm. Extra foods. Uh, yeah, I'll grab this here. There we go. So we're doing plus six damage, which is, you know, nice. Do I want this? I mean, it's armor. Armor's pretty good. It's on sale. I'll reserve it. A little big, but I'm probably going to end up getting armor anyway, so I'll have to replace it at some point. Ideally with something like holy armor. As we apply iron pan to uh, nearest target. Very effective solution to problems. Easy. Flawless victory. Alright, you are kind of thick, so that's going to be something to handle. Um, cap? I don't want to deal with that right now. I'll reserve this. Everything else can go away for the moment. I'm a little bit more armored up. And the shield will get replaced as well at some point. Ooh, a fire sword too. Okay. Oh, they're running out of stamina. I am not running out of stamina, courtesy of banana, and I am applying applying pan to forehead. Uh, ooh, another leather armor, but I really don't have the, um, you don't have the, uh, space for it. Ripsaw Blade is interesting to me. We tried the Rainbow Goobert. I have never successfully collected a Rainbow Goobert. It is not so simply done. Reserve this. I don't know that I want to reserve this. We're just going to let it go. Probably shouldn't have rolled that many times. <clears throat> Shield wrecked them. It certainly did, actually. It did a lot of damage. Well, it it gave me spikes. What the shield does is it uh, reduces for it thirty five percent chance to prevent four damage and removes zero point three stamina from opponents and gain one spike. Where spike deals one damage per stack when being hit by a melee weapon. Really, the big deal is the re removal of stamina. So let's do this, replace you, and then just roll. Much as I like the idea of, all right, we need you. It's always, always uh, fun to try. Hmm.
Do I want to shift these over? I think so. Let me have nice things. Thank you. Here, you go here, you go here, you go here. I suppose that'll do for now. <clears throat> I just don't want to redo everything at this point in time. Sweet. Plus 59 armor to start. It's beautiful. Shield keeping us in this game. Having three onions as well, helping with the whole armor thing, as their opponent slowly bleeds to death. If I bleeds to death, I mean, yeah, chokes on poison. Alright, so let's grab Venomancer. Venomancer, 5% chance for each luck to protect poison on your opponent from being cleansed. Start a battle, gain 4 luck and 30 maximum health for each pet. Every 2 seconds, inflict poison. Oh look, it's a pet. All right, so first off, we're gonna be getting one of these going here. I need space and more space. Reserve that for later. Uh, it's on sale. All right, there we go. So I need this to happen. Everything else is kinda less important right now. I want this. Which is more important to me right now. I'll get space back next turn. For now, I'm just going to float the armor, I think. Which is, it would be nice. Let's do it. This is gonna hurt. That's that's a big axe. Oh lord, they coming. I got stunned. Oh no. Uh, but we are getting holy crit. Yeah, I seen that one coming. Alright, sweet. Okay, so a few things. We now have poison goober. Every five item activation, cleanse two poison and inflict four poison. Which is just kind of good. Um, I guess I'll keep Pan for now, but I'm not super into it. I need this. I need... wants this. I think it's time to uh, redo a little bit here. Alright, so poison goob goes in the middle. You can go here, I suppose. Alright, no, not. Okay. Off we go. Alright. I'm wondering if it's worth it to put Snake in here. Probably not. Like, it's only a 25% chance. It's not bad, but it's not going to be speed boost great, I think. Okay. Hey there, Evan. Welcome, man. Fun game? I agree. Very fun game. Such a weird shape.
And then I need a fourth up there. Sweet. Which you replace later. And slide it down. Goobert goes here specifically. And everything else should be pretty clear here. Um, I wouldn't mind having holy armor here. And then shield up here. Is that... No, it needs to slide up one. Oh, no. In that case, we do this. In that case, we do this. Goob goes here. You go here. Oh, my God. Me trying to stack these here is such a mess. Alright. That's not going to fit now. Unless I do this. Which works. Alright, sweet. Um, pan is now less important than most things. Uh, pretty much everything for that matter. Uh, I don't even know that I need banana. We go with this for now. Let's do it. Is it an old class? It is an old class. Trying out the Venomancer. Do a nice clean Venomancer run before uh, jumping into the new one. You like Pyro the most? Zerker can be good too. Yeah, I, thematically, I definitely like Pyro the most. Fire makes me happy. this. we got another shield. Good. Do I want this? Like... Probably not. I probably want Holy Armor. Well, I mean, we do have... We do have... Um... So I can get mana going with it. But does that help me? If I get blueberries and mana, I could increase the chance of uh, preventing preventing cleansing from happening. I definitely need space, like more than most things. This is effectively mandatory. Moon Shield. That's another one I was thinking about. Moon Shield is pretty good. But Moon Shield really wants to work with other mana items. I think I don't want a second goob. Which would be interesting. So I could put a second goob right here. Get another... Get another four starting luck and 30 maximum health. Not that big a deal. Only two purses with that snake, but I can get four purses. Ooh, ice armor. Neat. Gonna have so many. Um, I guess I'm not actually cleansing generic debuffs. I'm just cleansing poison specifically. Hello there, Najee. Welcome in. 
I'm about to start taking a lot of damage. Yeah, okay. Alright, you go here and don't do that. No combining. A cap I will take. Would like a replacement melee weapon. There's a blueberry. Don't have mana generation. I think I need another purse first. This is interesting. There's space. Get poison as well. Is this that interesting? I mean, it's more poison. I don't think it's that interesting. It does remove luck. I don't think it's worth the price, not here. I do have quite a substantial amount of cleanse. You know, that's one thing I don't have. I don't have a scythe. It would be very nice to have a scythe. Because this person's running a poison build, and I just massively outpoisoned them. Which is, you know, awesome. Alright, uh, what to do? Let's do this, I suppose, just to get this in here for the moment. Uh, I need one of these. If I can find Scythe, that would be my goal. None of these things are Scythe. Okay then. Scythe, Corrupted Crystal are kind of the big things. Um, The Corrupted Cap... All forces planet side. Orbital strike inbound. Well, hello there. If it isn't a merchant Blake, <laughs> special gift for the backpack. <laughs> Great for the AOE radioactive build. Great for the AOE radioactive build. <laughs> Can we get some love and chat for Hawk Wolf coming in with the uh, the absolute banger? Oh, jeez. That new dono is fire. Good! I'm glad you enjoy. What is this game? This game is awesome, is what it is. Okay. So let's go ahead and uh, jump into this next round, because I'm out of gold. Oh my god. Why is this so, in so big? Did you miss? Didn't miss that time. It's out of stamina now. Oh boy. He's not missing anymore. Oh no. Oh boy. This stun. This stun, it hurts so much. Oh no. Let's see. Space is beautiful right now. I would like another bag. Question is moon shield, yes or no? Like, let me let me double check moon shield. Like it's just kind of better, isn't it? Twelve damage on attack period versus I guess it is 30 no I guess it is just better across the board we'll do that not that I'm really using mana for anything hmm. 
Let's boost this up. Grab another one of you, I think. This Corrupted Cap... I think I actually like, don't want Corrupted Cap here. As much as the introduction, the reduced damage by 25% is nice, it's only for 5 seconds. It's the crits that are going to be a problem for me. Okay. So much poison. Oh wow. Yeah, that's that's double oh god, double Fortuna arrows. Oh no. Oh it's gonna be painful. It's gonna be so painful. Yep. Yeah. Oh dear. Lock you. The Duke, where did it go? Uh, it didn't go very far. It went nowhere, actually. Not much of a mana producer. You were correct. It is not much of a mana producer. Oh, a strong pestilence potion, which is uh, a little bit better. I would like to have a scythe. Or, you know, a weapon that's good for poison. Oh, man's got a lot of cleansing potions. Uh-oh. Uh, oh, dear. He's about to cleanse so much of my poison. He's going to cleanse 30 poison. Total. Which is a lot of poison to cleanse. But I'm getting a lot of armor now, which is, you know, awesome. I'm into that. If I get some blueberries, I can start generating, generating, what is it called? <laughs> this is it in Curse's Backpack Battle Stream. Hey, yes. Um, not doing so well on Reaper here. Finally, Scythe. I don't know what to do with this now. Uh, I do not have, well, first off, Pan, this is going away. Like, a lot of this is going away. You need to be touching... How do I want to handle this? So I think I definitely want you touching Goob because you've got 1.4 second cooldown. Also needs to be touching... Also needs to be touching Snake and Goob. Just a little... A little awkward. Alright, so this is one of these. Also, welcome in time. Those who haven't seen time. He's a uh, great backpack battle streamer. Highly recommended. Everything goes in. We make the pile to this guy. I shouldn't have done that. It's a tip before I put it back. <laughs> Clearly you lack pig. Pig solves everything. <laughs> oh no. I had to sell pig earlier. Pig was too fat. Oh god. It's stuck. Alright. I had concern there for a moment. <laughs> Alright. Um, let's get you here. I guess you can fit here. But then Snake has to go here, question mark? Means I probably want this to look like this. Here. There. Like so. God, that's not amazing, is it? I'm glad you know you can do that. Speak not to me, the old magics, for I was there when they were written. Has been a while since I've since I've been around backpack battles, though. Uh. Oh boy, I missing a single. No, not here. Okay. All right. Um. Slide this over one. Which means I could do this, this, this. Yeah, alright, so that applies to it all, leaves two spaces open for Goob. Okay. I can work with that. 
Now, can I get this thing done nicely? The answer to that question is no, but I'm going to try anyways. I'm sorry, what just happened? Okay. Here, just get over here for the moment so I can see. All right. Actually, I can fit this guy right here. That'll do. Snake isn't touching Scythe. It is touching Scythe. Uh, Scythe has a weird hitbox. It's a very weird hitbox, which is fine. Get over here. Odd. I I mean I suppose so. <sighs> this is every three seconds, which is not a bad activator. This one is on block, which is also not a bad activator. I can't get both of these touching, which is unfortunate. How do I fix that? I mean, it's better than nothing, but... see a way of easily making those touch. Another hour fiddling section of every BPP match. A little bit. Uh, you know, it's not the worst thing to have happen, you know? It's fun. You gotta get involved. Alright, I don't need Pan anymore. You can go away. Do I care about any of these things? Not really. Because Box of Riches doesn't give me corrupted crystals. And I don't need stamina. I'm thinking I do shield here and put this guy here, is what I do. But for that I need more space down below. That doesn't count as space. Corrupted Crystal, however, is amazing. So we'll do some more shifting around a little bit later, but for the moment... Um, put you here, you just here for now, and... I'll save it for next round to sell. Okay. Go. I did see a funny ranger build that included one rapier and just an entire backpack filled with clovers, which was interesting. It worked really well. It, it basically one-shot me. And then it basically one shot me a second time. <sighs> All right, space is nice. This gives me what I need for this. Throw you here. That'll do. Also, we need corrupted crystal goes on armor. Yes, please. Nope, nope. Do I want a flask? Like, it's just a punch. It's not a bad thing to have. I forget what is flask, demon flask, corrupted demon flask upgrade to. Yeah. Definitely not worth the trade off of the corrupted crystal. But you know, 
maybe corrupted armor isn't the worst thing to have. I think the crystals are probably better. I definitely think the crystals are probably better. But a demon flask is just a one punch. It just does straight up damage. Opponent drops below 50% health. Consume this and deal 0.35 damage for each debuff. If you have, you know, 30, then it, it does hit for some damage, which is, you know, nice. No Twitch stream? There is a Twitch stream. Like 127 debuffs is 47 damage. Yes, yes, yes. Very yes. It's just... I can fit it on the board, I think. So I, I, I guess I should just pick it up. It's on sale. It's cheap. It's easy. It's free! It's something. I probably want more poison instead. <clears throat> we have so many poison stacks on the opponent. It's so very pretty. That dude is not keeping up with his stamina. And it's just he's just taking a lot of poison damage. Makes me happy. Uh, ooh, another one of these. Don't mind if I do... See if we get. So oh, that was there was a, there was a pouch there. Okay, should we stack the potions. The, they're as stacked as they get. That's 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 how that works. I'll grab another pestilence potion. More space. Ah, you're right. There it is. Okay. I rotated the wrong way. I think I want this. Uh, definitely want this. So this is purchased first, second, third. Gotta work with that. Although, I definitely want this, don't I? These will both dump at the same time, so I guess it doesn't really matter which one goes which. No, it does for now. So we need another poison agaric, or a mushroom agaric. Space, I'll take it. This still is for two. No big deal. Let's go. Let's do it. There, lots of poison. Man's covered in dragons, which is a build I haven't played around with at all. Or, or like a feature I haven't played around with at all, and I would like to do so at some point. He does have a phoenix, and didn't matter because he's taking 117 damage per hit. Which is, you know, a lot of damage. And see, poison starts ticking up to dealing 13, 17, 15, 21 damage per second, and it keeps going. Like by the end, it's up to 33 damage per second. Oh, it's a lot of damage. Compared to their um, dragons. Interesting that the. Uh, Gonna say, I was about to say, like, this is the obsidian dragon should be doing the most there. It was. Sweet. More armor. Don't mind if I do. Where can I put this guy? Not a whole lot of places, really. If I get a pouch. It's a pouch. Alright then, in that case, I can do this. Stop it. I could do this, this, pouch. What 
did I want to do with pouch? I wanted to do... This... And... Is that it? No, because it has to go sideways this way. Ah, I see. I need to adjust this a little bit. Slide you here. And slide you here. Put you here. This way I can put this guy here. Get maximum pouch pouchage. And now I'm missing one spot. Alright, well... Perfect. Right. What else did I want to do? We're gonna have this with more corrupted crystal. I would like to get a corrupted armor here, but doing so means doing so means uh Losing a corrupted crystal, which is not worth it for me at this point in time. We definitely don't need banana. He's not at this point. But I can put it in there because I've got nothing else to do. And I think we're good to go. There's something else I can do with this. Um, if I shift all of this up, I can get two more spaces here. Like so. And then extra space to put this somewhere else. Which means I can just put, I don't know, anything here. I wonder, does this count? It does. Oh, that's interesting. Interesting, but I not, don't really get to use it. Because it, it already applies twice because I'm putting it in the potion here. Okay. Here we go. Tetris update is sick. I agree. I'm corrupted armor for next run. I know, right? Bananas health too. I mean, yes, but... It's not that big of a deal. So I have a, I'm applying poison about twice as quickly and genning armor per second, which is kind of intense. We did it! We survived! You'll love to see it. We made it to silver. All right, so we're gonna try some of the new classes now. Uh, I tried pyro a little earlier and I'm into pyro. I like pyro a lot, just thematically. The dot is insane, it kind of is. Uh, I'm very into it. Let's pick up a spike shield here real quick. There's a banana. I'm a banana. Give me a banana. Burn it all. Yes, 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 we shall. We'd like another one of these. Uh, may as well purchase it. I'm not... Am I going to put it in... Uh... I've got two bananas. I, I could put it in. Or at least I've got a banana. I, I, I could put it in, right? We just won't have any, you know, fire. Which isn't that big a deal right now. We don't have any synergies with it. Okay. Yes, you with your two flame. <laughs> Berserker double axe builds or wield. Yes. All right, more space. Get coal. A little bit more flame because we can. And I don't need more of this. We do have a pig, though. Pig, 
pig overpowered. Let's do it. Hey there, Gersha Senior. How you doing? Welcome in, Dad. How you doing today? Man's going for some uh, upgraded, upgraded storage. Goob. We'll leave that for now. Make a torch. Burn torch. Game seems really fun. I agree. It is very fun. Do I want to save Goob right now? I mean, if I lock him now, he's going to be locked for a long time. This is, this is what's going on there. Not the worst thing, but it's not a good thing. Okay. Punch so hard. This goober is not activatable. Why are you like this? Oh, there's a draconic orb. Ah. Like, I gotta pick this up, right? It's just, it's kind of a rare item. I gotta pick it up, right? Like, just, just you know, to have it. And we'll just leave these on the shop for now. All right, there we go. Like, I'm trying to think: is there a world in which can you have too much draconic orb? Is my question. I don't know if you can. Like, just more draconic orb is just kind of better. Alright, so I'll pick up Goobert now. But I don't really intend to use him immediately for things and stuff. technically running out of stamina here. So let's rotate this this way, get a little bit more banana per banana. Is there anything else I should hear? I don't know if this is worth it over this guy. We'll probably won't get to find out immediately. Let's go. I did hit 10 flame. I need 15 flame to get critical. Not quite there yet. Alright, sweet. I mean, Cole's just always kind of decent, so I'll throw you on here. Free and it's good. I'll take it. Free TM. I should have rotated that torch. And it's got triple fly agaric. Beautiful. Alright, so I guess with the with the burning coal, I technically have flame generation. Um, oh, look what it is! It's another one. 
save that for next round. Uh, do I want to grab a shield here? Probably. That'd probably be a good idea. In that case, we'll save. Hello there. Is this ever quest but not? No, this is backpack battles. All right. Uh, once we get that 15... Oh, we hit 15. It's crit time. It's crit o'clock. Yeah, suddenly spike of damage. Alrighty, so how do I want to handle this? Ashbringer. Start a battle, lose 50% health. But before defeat, re reincarnate 50% life. And become invulnerable for 2 seconds. And on reincarnation, deal 5 damage for each fire item. And inflict 6 debuffs for each dark item. We have Firebender. Every 3.5 seconds, use 1 mana to gain 2 fire. Triggers 10% faster for each fire item. Uh, at 20% fire, uh, heat, I guess, we uh, gain 5 luck. At 40, we regain 15 regeneration. And 80, we deal 100 damage, which is substantive damage. We also have Dragon's Nest, which is, you know, just kind of cool. Haven't played Dragon's Nest yet, so kind of want to. I think we'll do friendly fire this time. That's your favorite quest. Hey, graphics is good. <laughs> Can you imagine? Uh, so this thing does... Uh, this thing gives us more... Oh, uh, given my lack of space, I'll pick up the draconic orb right now. We'll hold out on the rest of the stuff. We need space more than most things. Counts as space. And I can sell. Do I want to sell a heat for this? Yeah, just get it out of here. Beautiful. <clears throat> Good morning there, Andromeda. How are you doing today? Helldivers 1 is uh, $8 USD for everything. Oh my. Not super into the idea of Helldivers 1. The isometric top-down doesn't do it for me. Helldivers 2, on the other hand. Now that... That's, uh, that's a good time all around. More fire for the fiend. More Draconic Orb! Oh, out of Holy Armor. Alright, um... Mm. I think what we're going to do here is... It only goes up to 9... 10, 11... Can't wait for uh, the tank and Helldivers 2. Can you... There's so many cool toys that I'm sure are coming out. Like, I very much so look forward to it. I, uh, my brother came over today for lunch. So I, uh, he hadn't played Helldivers before, so I had him run through a mission. It was hilarious, I'll say it. I'll just tell you that. Alright, uh, I'm not sure I can actually get this to fit here. Oh, I don't have enough for it. I can't sell banana. Okay. Sun shield is just kind of nice. Mm. 
do I have enough to... I can, yes. Put it this way. And so... I can fit the sun armor here, but in... Or not the sun armor, the holy armor. But I have to sell a couple things for it. And I really, really, really don't want to sell any of the things for it. So I'll just keep this position in mind for now. And come back to it later. Purchase this instead. <clears throat> Once I have the armor, it should help immensely with the whole... With the whole heat generation thing. I'm getting nibbled to death. Okay. Uh, mana. Here we go. Mana is a good time. We need mana. Some mana generation to go a long way. Can I get sun armor this turn? Yes. I need banana in play. That's not really a question. Hmm. Guess I can just sandbag one round for it. So I'll get more space back. Alright. Alright, so this blueberry is most of my heat generation right now. Which is not much heat generation. Uh, I haven't found heat generating items. Which is a little bit unpleasant. God, we're honking so much, the stamina it hurts. Almost got it anyways. Hey, here's some items. This is very important to me. So this actually consumes heat, which will be a problem for me. Not as much of a problem as uh, missing out on some other things. I need space. Oh my god. I don't... You don't count as space. I guess this counts as space. banana. Can I also draconic? I guess I don't really need all the draconic right now. I need so much more space, please. This is not space, but it is another draconic. I hate it. I hate it. I'm gonna reserve it. There is such a thing as too much draconic. Um, Wolpertinger. Wouldn't be a bad thing to have, but I certainly don't have the space for it right now. Um, I think I'm... In the interests of... In the interests of actually being able to generate heat, I'm going to put the blueberry in over the draconic ore, because otherwise I'm just not going to be able to get heat in general. This hurts for me to be floating this much gold worth of stuff, but I just don't have room for it. Uh, that's not true. I can put it over here in place in place of this. I still count as heat items and they don't. It's gonna lower my starting heat, but oof. Combine pepper with goob. You need two peppers, I believe. Is it? No, it's only one pepper. You're right.
Yeah, that would have been important to do. So I don't have so many things. All right, chili Gubert. <sighs> so I'm going to purchase this and roll for space. Counts as space. Just get onto the board, please. Another shield. I would like Wilbertinger and the mana orb. I guess a second blue berry would work too. Second blue berry would work too. Second blue berry probably be better anyways. Than a mana orb. But uh, mana orb will work in place. Definitely need more stamina. We are cleansing debuffs quite quite quickly, which is keeping us alive from the poison as we slowly deal damage by punching punching the opponent down. We did it. Alright, much better. Next, I think I'm going to do this, just to give me an opportunity to get more stuff. This is a horrible place for this thing. This is a better place for this thing. We'll pretend her. It stays in the shop for now. Phoenix! I think I don't really want this. Hmm. So with Chili Goober, we actually now have some decent mana generate or heat generation. I uh, could use stamina as the big thing now. Uh, for that, we need space and will protect her. So we will this and let it go oh my lord man's getting himself a prime slime look at it it's the goobert okay uh this counts as space. Uh, can I get my candy? Get a Wolper Tank. All right. This should help with the whole stamina thing. There we go. I didn't look to see if we were good on mana. We're probably good on mana now. Uh, we appear to be good on mana. Uh, we are getting a lot of our heat and buffs nullified. Uh, but we are keeping up in the damage and keeping our own debuffs down. I'm not quite generating heat fast enough to get uh, to get to the final tier friendly fire. But Looking pretty good anyways. Let's see, what did our damage look like here at the end? In terms of DPS. Yeah, Burning Torch just doing great damage with 12 and 16 DPS over the course of the match. Uh, still, still a little low on stamina. Could use another banana. Uh, but for any of that, we need space. This counts. Mm. 
Let's do this. Better. Let's slide this down. Start building fire atoms over here. In fact, is there a reason I don't do this right now? No, it's the answer to that question. That should be better, yeah. Is this similar to that auto pet battler thing from a while back? Yes, very. I see a potion here. It can make golden pan. No. Um, this could help immensely if I get space for it, which I think we can do next round. Another blueberry. This mana orb's probably better than the blueberry at this point. We don't need more. I can sell. Nah. We'll just wait till next round. Cap is just nice to have. So we'll roll with that. Use some more fire items here. There we go. Better starting heat, which would be nice. We're at max starting heat from this. This is as max as it's going to get. This has got some great activators on it. Very great activators. Actually, this is a better activator, isn't it? 2.5 seconds. This is something that maybe, if time, if you're still here, do you know? Draconic Orb. If the opponent has no thorns, does it still activate for the purposes of a chili goop? This is something I don't know. That I would like to know. If that's if it's true, I can just slide one over there and be done with it. Or at least I have a better activator. Slightly better activator. <coughs> In the not so exact words of Squidward, word, oh no, she's hot. Like flaming hot. Everything is on fire levels of hot. That man's starting with a lot of uh, initial heat. And it hurts a lot. Hello there, Qualda. How are you doing today? A cheaper Wilper Tinger! Um, I'm into that. I'm into that a lot. So we do this, this. Let's put this here. Blueberry can kind of go anywhere. Orb's got to go next to an activator. It's a good one. Wilbur Tingers is such a cute amalgamation. I suppose so, yes. Uh, let's purchase this and then roll. Let's purchase this and roll again. Another potion. Okay, how many orbs is too many orbs? <laughs> Can't use the ones we have. going to purchase it because I need something. Okay. Like, I, I need something. A lamp. Not insta-lamp. We have a Belladonna's Whisper. Which is the uh, the poison varietal? Oh hey, we hit the eighty percent, or we hit the eighty heat, which just means that we one shot the guy, basically. 
He finally did it. Look at it. He's got 113 HP and then just gets nuked by the friendly fire, which is a very, very fun phrase to say. All right. Give me space. This counts. All right. Uh, I could put you here and you here. More fire just on the field. Okay. One or two orbs. I don't see why I would need more orbs. If you have a good argument for more orbs, I am open to more orbs. But I would need an argument for it. things here. How do I fit another welfare tanger in here? Ideally over here. Should immensely help with whole stamina issues. It's fine. It'll do. And now that we have a heroic potion, we should be okay. And we have one, two, three, four, five, so we will get what is that? 20 crits guaranteed, which is just kind of, you know, amazing. So now I'm feeling a bit more comfortable. We should be able to um, upkeep our weapons now. So much cheese. Yeah. All right. So not fully upkeep the weapons because heat generates so fast and we do so much attack speed. But with the potion coming in, we can keep it going consistently until we get the nuke. And even then, we still hit rapidly. Let's see what kind of damage we ended up doing it toward the end of this one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, so 23 and 17 DPS apiece, which is pretty good, which is, you know, really good. Okay. Ta-da! We did it! So there's our pyro. Let's go over here try out this one. I haven't done this one in, you know, yet. So many on sale things. Um. Yeah. I grab potion because it's cheap, it's easy, it's free. Why not? Where's pig? Why not pig? Anything for one? No. I don't know if I'm gonna need the space, but I, oh, banana. Reserve banana. Banana and space? Banana and space. I'm scared. I'm gonna play Rogue Core when it comes out solid, maybe. Now, do you want that other blueberry? Eh, mediocre. I don't really need it. I already had a solution to the problem in the form of uh, an orb. Right. Start merging this. Do you want a gym box early? I kind of want a gym box early. Let's get a gym box early. In that case, we'll save. We now have stamina, which I think we don't actually need yet. 
Is it like it's just a single wooden sword? Like the pig sail? Uh, you were correct. I probably should have picked up pig sail. Banana in the bag. Uh, yeah, you're correct. Banana in the bag. Do you want another banana yet? Don't really need mana. I haven't seen a shield. Don't know that I want to go tusk shield. Grab this. Grab this. Let's do it. A hammer. Interesting. A hammer and a broom, which is an definitely an unexpected combo. Ow. Did a lot of damage. Got bonked on the head. Right, sell you. You up. I don't really want to go with Hero Longsword, but I mean, Whetstone's just kind of nice to have. Axe! <clears throat> Axe is kind of good. No hammer camos a pig? I did. Definitely gonna need stamina now. Double axe build? I'm thinking of doing something double axey. Yeah, similar to Backpack Hero. I mean, it is similar to Backpack Hero, it's just, you know, PvP. Um, do I want Steel Goober for this? I don't think I do. Regular Goober might be okay. Actually. I think we do go steal Goober here, because I have it already. Just to ramp up damage, just scale it. This turn. This will get us some scaling as we go. What is the uh, chill jazz song plays in the background? You can use the playlist command to uh, see the full list. I believe this is playlist two. We have playlist one and playlist two. Alrighty. Rotate you. Gonna need to re redesign this substantially. You go here. You go here. Don't need whetstone anymore. Just need activators. We 
Ready for the playlist? Use the uh, the playlist command here. Playlist to. That should be the, uh, the the list that you're looking for. As always, you can see the current song playing in the bottom right corner of the screen. And so right now, I really don't have any activators for my dudes. Uh, 3.5, 1.9. That. Um. Yes. Okay. Dragon claws. I probably want that. Okay. They changed the art style of this game. Uh, not... no. No, they haven't. He's not to my knowledge, at least. There's the other axe. Alright, we've got a lot... we've got enough space for once. Cheese? No. I mean, fine, but no. Crap, axe around corner group. Yeah, yeah. Once I, it's just kind of having space issues, but we'll be we'll be rede redesigning things as we go along. <clears throat> okay. I keep getting emeralds, and this displeases me immensely. All right. All right. So, uh, you, I don't need to do much with you anymore. We now have Dragon Claws. Star items trigger faster. While uh, during Battle Rage, which would be sweet. So we can do a few things here. Uh, but first, I think I just want to merge these. Just get a double axe going before doing anything else. Really, no easy way to do this, is there? There's not. And a star item. Counts as something. All right. Well, board is hard to build. We'll be redesigning it shortly, anyways. More space. Don't need that much space, but it's the fanny pack specifically which I'm into. So we we'll start it. <sighs> Eddie, you know the music video. I already have a good one there. Digital. Good luck out there. Did she put you in a bag? Shh, solid, maybe. You'll love to see it. Goob getting so much armor. Steel Goober is just kind of good. Alright, subclass unlocked. Which one do we want? It's so big, look at the double axe. Every time it attacks, it gets two damage. is just amazing. All right, so we can go with the fighter. On hit, chance to stun for uh, 0.5 seconds. They gain an accuracy rate, which is just, and nearby items gain an accuracy rate, which is nice. Uh, generate a flame for each crafted item. The uh, gets additional damage. I'm not really into the heat mechanic for this right now. 
Deerwood Guardian, damage taken reduced by 10%. Battle Rage lasts 5 seconds longer for each nature item, or half a second longer for each nature item. And for every 1 second during Battle Rage, heal for 7 and gain 2 mana. Which is an interesting combo. I think I'm not gonna be not gonna be doing that. A uh, pack leader. Wealth companions are offered in the shop. We have at least five uh, empower. You have a 30% chance to resist debuffs and yeah. Star weapons gain 10% crit chance, plus 10% for rich pet. Wow, cool. No, thank you. Uh, shaman mask. Runes are offered in the shop. Start a battle gain one clover for each socketed gemstone. Every three seconds, use two luck to gain two random buffs. Between that and uh, fighter, I think we'll just go basic fighter, I think. That or the shaman. Which one, which one? You know what? Like... This one's just so straightforward and effective. This one, this one's quirky though. Let's go with this. Alrighty then. We don't need another axe, but I wouldn't mind taking another box of riches. All right, so how do we want to set this thing? Because we got some adjustments that need to be made now. Uber can go there. This can go here. This battle rage triggers items in here. Which means you. And you. And this should be approximately maximum baggage. If I do this, I can get even more. I don't have more to give. Uh, we are going to be bleeding stamina here hilariously quickly. Alright, so he receives weapon damage and is an activator. If I can slide you out further, I can have this get the damage as well, which I would like to do. you're no longer an activator. Do it like... Ah, uh, boy. Alright, never mind. I'll do this. We'll save our space for other things. You'll be an activator. You'll be an activator. More interested in the runes. Hmm. Don't have good activators for this. All right, so I need space, gems, and runes. On hit, trigger 3% faster. During battle rage, reduce damage taken by 7. Stamina. Items use 10% less stamina. That's amazing. Spiked color. <laughs> Legendary accessory. All right. Battle rage lasts longer. And anti battle rage gain stacks. Gain one spike. You know, the, um... That just sounds fitting. Gloves on banana. Gloves on banana is actually a great idea. Is there a reason I don't put this all up there? Knows the answer to that question. Okay. 
this game PvE or PvP? Uh, it is PvP. However, it's not live PvP. It's battle rage time. We're gonna chop. We chopped. Okay. Heroic potion would be good. So you, I just want you in the backpack for 10% less stamina. This, on the other hand, goes anywhere. For longer battle rage per battle rage. I would like to have probably a stamina potion. We'll reserve it. Here we have badger room, same thing. Just socket these anywhere for the moment. I probably do actually want to badger rune on the double axe. Cryo Pyro. It scales up to so much damage so very quickly. I mean, double axe, it just hits. It hits so very so very hard. Alrighty, uh, we're not inflicting debuffs really. Um, uh, uh, weapon socket, not super into it. Backpack, no, okay. Do I want a shield of valor? If I upgrade it into a moon shield. Eh. I think we'll be fine. Hmm. I wouldn't mind some life steal. We don't do Shield the Valor. At least not right now. I probably want the armor first over Shield the Valor, but Shield of Valor is here. Uh, can I merge? I don't need this. This is not. There we go. Space, not space. That counts as space. Get a potion now. Could use some more banana. Hey there, fish. Welcome in. How are you doing today? Would also be nice to have a stam sack. Just to have, you know, more stamina. God, we hit so hard. You're doing your part. Good! Super Earth needs you. Alright. More space, please. Wolpertinger! We don't get that many buffs. This is space, and I love to see it. No, I don't mind getting a health potion. I can upgrade a health potion. Okay, let's do this. Let's do this. I'll keep this for next turn. dragon eggs. They're doing a lot of damage up front to me. Oh, 
it's because they have like five weapons, so they're just running out of stamina. They blew through all their stamina, and now they <laughs> have nothing to hit me with. I just love watching the axe slowly gain damage over time. You slowly increase the amount of hits. Shaman gives you buffs. Yes, but it's not many buffs is what I was is what I was getting at. Like it gives five random buffs for using two luck, and I only get what one, two, three of that. So fifteen total, which is fine but it's not we're not talking uh huge amounts here all right oh i need two of these no i didn't need two of these why didn't you merge oh god it merged with my banana i'm in danger Alright then, um... What to do? But I hope it works out! Got a little heat off of that. Got a lot of mana from that. Oh, it's because I have sapphires. Sapphires are generating mana. Generate a lot of mana at that, too. Whew! Danger. And see, in terms of DPS, me, I was basically just dying to his spikes. He didn't have a whole lot of actual damage output. Looks like mostly due to a lack of stamina. Probably because I have a shoot. Compare this to me, who just axes him a question. Something fierce. Alright, sweet. Stam sack here to play. That will help. Uh, ten maximum health and a random buff. We don't really heal much, do we? We do have a cheese goober. Cheese goober opportunities. Fifteen maximum health and two random buffs. I don't think I got a four to second goober. Not on this board. But I will pick up a cheese. Alright, so I'm pretty much hard rolling for stamina here. None of these things are stamina. Okay. What's the uh, stam potion and the health potion doing? With whatever connection they have? Uh, they are, I'm going to describe it as mixing. The stamina potion mixes with the health potion, and so when I drink the health potion, I get the effects of the stamina potion and the health potion simultaneously. Um, it works gravity-wise, so I have I have effectively two stamina potions and one health potion. Cap is gem slot. It is gem slot. I I think I don't currently want it. I mean. I've got space and a cap here. So I do want it. Earth inbound flare? Oh no. Well. More flare. 
It would be nice to have something that um, synergizes with the... Uh... Oh no, we got we got poisoned. It would be nice to have something that synergizes with the mana. Um... 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 Okay. Are we a villain sword build now? <sighs> also, Aurora Borealis. Is it an Aurora Borealis if it's in Florida? Um, I I think I'm not going to take it. And the reason for that is we already have Steel Goober and a Giant Axe. And therefore, switching at this point is going to be difficult. Like, I don't have things that can work with it very well. Um, I would have to go, like, full Knives. Get rid of that. I would have to get rid of everything. I have to get rid of Goobert. I would actually probably keep that. I would keep the hammer. Uh, I would have to get rid of the axe. I'd have to get rid of Goobert. I'd have to get rid of most of the things I have on the board. Um, we would lose our gems. The shaman mask would not do much. And the dragon gloves uh, have anti synergy with this. So we're going to not go for it. But also, there's a banana here, which is kind of nice. Okay, so a few things. This can go anywhere else. The emerging? No. Okay. Um, I want banana here. Means we can do this. Uh, do we have a better activator for this? Shield is a way better activator of this. Can have enough space to redo a lot of this now. cheese you guys synergize with nothing because you're eco you can go off in a corner somewhere potions synergize with nothing effectively you go anywhere okay that's this is a better better lineup here time. Sweet. Do I want this to be in Zerker gloves? In that Zerker bag? Then during battle rage, it doesn't get the. Th uh, no, I think we're just gonna do this for now. Much as we, we could change it later. As the uh, the gloves are, they give a stronger bonus. Oh hey, it's a shield. 
They have a lot of armor. It'd be a shame if I didn't ignore armor like 90% of the time. It's not actually 90% of the time. It's just pretty high. We are keeping up with the stamina-ish. No, we're not. We're just using our potion to do it. Okay. Got some more sapphire upgrades. Let's do this. Have another set of gloves here. Um, gloves would work pretty well for getting another dragon claws, which I like the idea of that. We need space, which we can do here. If I get up to 30 mana, I gain 12 random buffs, which is just not amazing. But I can do an upgrade to the mana shield. I can upgrade this to a mana shield. Hey there, Jonathan. How are you doing? Welcome back. Hmm. A mana shield. We may actually activate this mana warp this time, which would be interesting to me. At least, you know, funny. One of the two. Um, can I move any of this around? Yes, yes, I can. Now we get it on both gloves. And we're good. Gloves aren't a gem slot. There we go. Alright, sweet. Much better. Alright, so we start with a whopping 9 luck, which is actually pretty reasonable amounts of luck. Unfortunately, we lose it rather quickly because Shaman Mask. Also, he's draining my luck with the bird thing. Wow. We just... The crits. He hits so very hard. Yeah, he's got 21 DPS and 12 DPS. That's a lot of damage. We did not live very long. Alright, so now the shield will work against ranged attacks, which will be, you know, nice. Um. Another health potion. Wouldn't mind another health potion. Now we have another gloves. Bruce banana even higher. Sapphire. Doesn't merge with anything right now. That's fine. Another helmet. Stop us from getting crit. I don't really have much healing other than lifesteal. Let's get into the gem slots. We can put this up here. Let's go. Um, the bonus attack speed on the axe is definitely going to mess up our stamina. Because we're now attacking, what is it, 10% faster? 20% faster, which we absolutely do not have the stamina to do. Not even a little bit.
Okay. How much damage did we get up to there? As we scale up to 22, 28, we hit 30 DPS, 30.9 DPS. We did hit 30 mana. Uh, not that I have an active orb. Alright, so, holy armor. I would like this. I would like that a lot. What can I sell for it? Besides from space, I need space. Can I get it up here? Yes, I can. It's, it does have a cleanse effect. There we go. Now. do hang on to that for the moment okay bottom gloves on banana yes Doesn't need to be on the axe because the axe is limited by stamina. Okay. We're not quite up to a perfect sapphire yet. Oh, that's so much poison. Good thing we got a holy armor with a bunch of with a bunch of uh, <sighs> with a bunch of fanny packs on it because it's that's a lot of poison coming our way. Yeah, yeah. Look at that. He had two hundred armor and we didn't care. We just cut clean through with the armor pen. You love to see it. All right, sweet. A Wolpertinger? I can't get... Wait, these are just... I don't mind if I do. Oh, a blueberry every 3.5 seconds gives us a luck, which actually isn't that, that great, because I would need two luck to have it converted into random buffs. I'm going to grab it anyways. Is this last round? Yeah, this is last round. Okay, so we don't need... Here. Merging is no longer meaningful. The true damage is insane. Yes. Plus, you go up to get poison resist. Yes. I suppose that's nice. Oh, hey, look, another rune. Um, wouldn't mind that. What can I sell for it? Box of riches? Yeah. We put it on an armor slots. As much of this stun is nice. Debuff would be very nice. I think that's it. That's all we got. Yeah. 
This is last round, so we sell this. And this would be stronger than this. One, two, three, four. Put it on a weapon. I can put it on a weapon. And I can't afford it. Um, yeah, I'll take the poison resist, I guess. But now where do I put it? Resist debuffs. Good. And that is not all. I grab this for the bonus 7 armor. Yay, we did it, chat. Beautiful. Can be streaming for a bit still? Indeed I will. Look at all the- This is the build I was talking about before. It just insta-crits- Jesus Christ! Helmet definitely kept us alive there. For any amount of time. Holy smokes. Okay. Stun on hammer? Yes, that's what I intended to put it, and then I put it over there instead. So... This is a scary build, this right here, because it starts out with like 60 DPS and then doesn't get worse from there. Like look, turn one, this thing, this guy has, he hits for 44, That's f and then immediately hits again for another 53. Like it just... Just cranks the damage up and it keeps getting more and more damage. It's just, just disgusting. I'm over here with a whopping 11 DPS by comparison. And, um, like he's up to 60 DPS. Is not good. It's not great. And of course, I, I scale my damage because I slowly ramp up. So now, I, you know, I go up to 20 DPS. He's still at still at 60. I'm going up to 30. He's still at 60. 35. Down to 50-ish. The only reason I live is because I have a lot of regen. And he doesn't. I'm doing truish damage. Like, oh my god. Is that a good glass cannon build? It is. Uh, it also doesn't keep up the damage forever. Um, the rapier, the way it works, is it does... It uses... It uses... Um, luck to deal damage. To increase its damage. And if it misses then it gains luck. So it's not purely a glass cannon, but it is it is pretty glass cannony. And the way he does this is he starts uses these clovers to get a ton of starting luck and then just consumes them. So he gets like four swings of stupid damage, stupid level damage, before it tapers off. Of course, he's also got double insta-lamp. Is that insta-lamp? Is it requires... Yes, it is certainly a lamp. Because this exists. 40 random other buffs. Ugh. So he gets double insta-lamp into fancy rapier with 100% accuracy critting for 100 damage. And of course he's got stacking acorn collars for the guaranteed crit every shot it's just stupid damage is he's very 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 effective 
Um, so that's a thing that happens. I'm amazed we survived that. I'm certainly amazed we survived that. How did I survive that? He did... How much damage did he actually do? He did 729 damage to my 576 by the end of it. Which means I regenerated my entire health bar about 1.5 times. Uh, potions definitely helped with that. But I just regenerated through it all. I just didn't really care is what happened here. Holy smokes. Constant mana and invulnerability. Yes, yes they do. Which I probably should have picked up one of those. So I had plenty of mana to spend, and I did see a crown. Okay, well that was exciting. Uh, so we've done... The only class we haven't done is Ranger. Let's do that one. Pots and Helm, as soon as they counter the burst. The Helm definitely is the reason why I didn't, you know, immediately die. Do I want to go... Tuskbow? I don't know. I don't know what I want to go Tuskbow. Hmm. I can't put it on the board. Here you are, blind. Yes, blind. Goobert Strat win. Uh, I've not found a way of getting... I don't know what kind of high roll you have to do to get the Prime Slime himself. Super Goober, because... Like, you need to find five Gooberts. I've, like, the most Gooberts I've found in an entire run is, like, three? That you have to find five Gooberts and their associated buffs? Like, what... What do? Here, pig. Go, pig. Go. Moon shield plus armor plus sapphires can make a life block. Yeah. That was probably relevant. So I had a lot of sapphires on the weapons, generating substantial mana. Which I wasn't using almost at all. Alright, um. Oh, God, it's Oh, no. I don't want any of this. Give me some. Shiny pack. Tempted to pick up stones and bag of rocks. Get some armor, I guess. There's a spear. Here's another wooden sword. Um. Double banana. I was thinking about it. It's cheap. It's easy. Do I want to go... Like hero longsword. Crossblades is still a thing, I think. Spear. Eh. Is this multiplayer? It is multiplayer. Well, it's asymmetrical, so while I'm playing other humans, uh, it is, for all intents and purposes, single player. Hmm. 
we're getting close to a uh we're, we're getting a little closer to a uh cross you know i haven't touched cross blades in a long time there's a good reason for that but uh still Yes, Charlton, that's exactly what it does. It keeps your build in the cloud and throws people at it. I'm gonna believe in crossblades so hard, but it's so hard to make it not it's so hard to make and not worth the risk even. So you try other ridiculous things. Yeah, yeah, that's my conclusion as well. You're playing other people's builds, or are they in the game now? No, I'm playing other people's builds, but it's uh it's not like there's another person that's sitting there playing against me. It just saves the build in the cloud as it as uh Trout put it, and loads it as necessary. Got an early roll pertainer. All right, so this will give us the one of the swords that we're looking for. Um, how to do this? This will do just fine. You know, I kind of want to play a hammer dagger build. A hammer dagger build would be nice. Oh, so it looks like we're getting Comcasted. I'm going to hold out for a moment. So, uh, same as Super Rado Pet, same route? Yes, 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 it is. Uh, so you guys should be able to hear me as much as the internet is struggling with something fierce right now. So how you guys doing? I have a cup of blueberries. Mm. <clears throat> I also have a new tea. A friend of mine um, brought some tea over from Korea. South Korea. It's pumpkin and red bean. And it is tasty. I'm very happy with it. Uh. <clears throat> Ooh. It tastes so good. The bits are low, but the audio is good. Yes, yes, yes. That's usually how it works. This is not live service as long as the servers are not dead, the game can work. Yes, it's the asymmetrical multiplayer. Um, you are playing against other players. It is PvP, but not live PvP. You're playing against ghosts of them, which is, you know, nice. Comcast hurts you too. Yeah, yeah. Almost done with work for the week. Another 20 minutes, and then tomorrow's paintball. Paintball, really? I am interested. I used to do... I used to do paintball a lot. Um, I did some pretty hardcore level milsim, both in airsoft, well, in airsoft, and that was after my paintball years, where I played incredible amounts of paintball. Um, I imagine you do. Well, I don't want to assume. Did you do? Do you prefer speedball or woods ball? Like grapes, putting grapes in the freezer as a snack. I. Need to do that. I have a bag of grapes that has been partially consumed and I need to freeze them.
because mildly crunchy grapes are tasty. Mm. <clears throat> ah, yes. I'd say now is a good time to do backpack rearrangement, but we'll, we'll hold off on that for the moment. Me and fruit, I, I enjoy fruit probably too much. I like it. I said, I remember I, um, <clears throat> I was a paintball referee for a while. <laughs> You're hungry. Oh no, it would be a shame if we talked about food. You crush them with your woods ball setup and you play a casual woods ball, but it's just a small field, 33 versus 30. Yeah, that, that does sound like a lot of fun. I'm, I'm, I prefer woods ball over the speed, speed ball. It's like so much. Everyone else that I know prefers speed ball and I'm not into it as much, but you know, it's fine. The game downloads the builds locally. You can play this even when the servers are down. No idea how long it would stay fun, but the whole idea is that games can be played without internet it seems to be lost on people and devs. It definitely does not do that. You need internet. But, um... I imagine it is plausible to do this. To do that. Given the quantity of players and builds, I imagine it would not be a good idea to try to download them all. Just like a representative set. But then the game would get kind of gamey, where you start building against specific builds. Some uh, frozen bananas. I just freeze my bananas. Like I, I get a bunch of, but like a bushel of banana, not a bushel, but a, a cluster of bananas. Eat like two of them, and then freeze the rest and turn them into milkshakes later. Well, smoothies later. Ah. You are correct, I can min-max this a little bit. Oh, why? Here we go. Um, yeah, I'll just leave that there. It's fine. It uh, looks like the pixels are coming back. Let's jump into it. <coughs> you prefer woods ball over uh, speed ball? <laughs> Play with your gear against Millicent is just for fun. It's understandable. Yeah, no, it's... I, that sounds like a good time. Do you have any favorite stories? Any time where you managed to uh, assassinate a target and they didn't know you were there? Hunch them down, perhaps. All right, so we got Pig. We got Lucky Pig. And we have a Falcon Blade. Start a battle, items trigger 30% faster, which is, you know, awesome put you here now do this here 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 and I probably want you over here now because you are gonna take all the stamina So right now, Falcon Blade is probably my best DPS because it attacks twice. It does a lot. It just means you get to do substantial damage. Um, grab bag, Gubert. Hmm. Yeah. Gust to roll for the good. It's
Ooh, holy armor. Don't mind if I do. Stem suck. I don't, I don't need space right now. What I need is... I don't need more gloves of haste. Blueberry. Uh, we're not going luck. So we'll just let it go for now. All right. <clears throat> You're making you crave fruit, but you don't have any. Oh no, whatever shall you do? Get to see the uh, DPS happen live. Falcon Blade. Not all that much for damage output, realistically. Yeah, we're on fatigue, t fatigue hour. And, yeah, I'm losing. All right. Poison built up. So, I think I'm going to try this one because it's fun. Uh, let's see. Pumpkin. Unique. No. 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 I had to think about that one for a moment. I wouldn't mind a lucky shield, however. Okay. Need whetstones? Yeah, I need three more whetstones. Or just, you know, one more whetstone and a goober. That would work too. Um, this guy does not yet have heat generation. I'm just happy that we're not running out of stamina here. But we're also not damaging him very highly. Like, at all. We do not have any damage. Okay. <sighs> luck, luck, luck. There's a goober. Carrot goober isn't what I want. Yes, yeah, it's temporary power up. If I get one more whetstone, which I will probably be able to get, then I can at least turn Goob into a uh, Steel Goober. Oh god, the crit. Whew, that was close. Goober definitely saved me there. Falcon Blade, much more damage this time around. Probably because they didn't have a shield. Uh, Alright, we definitely want the eight corn. Eight corn collar. Half mine to take this just for the, uh, the holy armor. I don't really need it. get us some substantial damage up, but hey there, crab, welcome in. 
Falcon Blade double attack seems to count for a group. Of, it does, which is quite the good. Like Falcon Blade, I don't want to sleep on Falcon Blade. It's good. It just it needs scaling damage because it itself doesn't doesn't do all that much. Like it's nice. It just doesn't do enough. I'm going to need substantive space. Feed the Beast Revelation still based mod pack. It is quite the. It is quite good. Craig, did you ever play my uh my my Minecraft uh my Minecraft custom world? I'm curious. It's been like a year and a half, two years now, but still curious to think how to see how you go through it. Ugh, God, we are not getting this done. That's a fancy fencing rapier if we want to do that, but that relies less on the rapier than it does the uh, the mega clover and the lamps. All right, let's swap these out. Can I do that this time? I can do that this time. I think it did. Understandable. Okay. I was curious because uh. I was wondering what you were thinking, what you would have thought about it, because it was a maddening experience. Garlic or luck? I don't have luck generation, is the thing. So I just need lots of clover. In order to get luck generation, I would need something like... A Four blueberries. The new class is fun to play? I think so, yes. Hey, there's what's done. Alright. That's important. That's very important. Um, that'll be next round. Okay. <clears throat> it's a 46 stand for? Uh, I will have to look on the screen for where you see the number 46. This man has one of every potion. Alrighty then. Okay, so a few things. We need this to be upgraded. I need... Do I need... I don't really need this, do I? Do. Hmm. Heart container to be okay, but not right now. Uh, so this can get us our steel goob. We can at least scale Falcon Blade here. Bottom left. Oh, that's our current rank. We're playing ranked. The, uh, it's fine. Moving to Twitch because this is understandable. Hmm. I think we leave it as is? Question? No. I think I probably need to do this now because failure to do so now means high chance of death. We're just not feeling particularly lucky today. This is fine too. Unless we get like two whetstones in the next shop. We're going to still goof and just pumping this falcon blade. This man has got so many weapons. 
Ripsaw and spear and shovel. You do not have stamina for this. Not even a little bit. Like, you could go rage and then just not be able to do anything with that. If you like any more weapons, me too! Me too. Hello. This doesn't help me, does it? It deals plus one damage per heat. I don't have heat generation. Um, you have 2% chance to resist debuffs for each uh, clover and gain one heat and one luck for each magic item, which I do not have. However, we do have a lamp here, and I'm into that. Okay. So now we can... Now we can merge this here. Uh, let's just do this. Merge you. I'll have to rearrange everything later. You can slide this over. Bonus goodies. Alright, so lamp. Give me space, please. Thank you. Clover, 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 clover. Uh, mana and spikes. I do need mana. Let's unreserve this because I don't have. Okay. Hello. Double Shield of Valor. And Falcon Blade beside a Hero Sword so we can scale. Uh, we don't have... We don't have any scaling right now. We won't until Goobert comes through. Double Shield of Valor could keep us in for a long time, though. Especially if we get the moon shields going. I think we're gonna pass on it this time. So it scales just not weapons. Only by plus two, which I guess would be would have been substantial this time around, I guess. That that would have been notable this time because the Falcon Sword only does four damage. So plus two is, you know, plus fifty percent damage, which would have been good. Yeah, that probably would have actually made the difference between uh, success and defeat here. Now that I think about it. Uh, let's try it again. Let's go until we get a win with this. Um, I will grab this guy again because it's kind of good to have. Got a banana. There's just a whole shield here. What's done? Okay. <clears throat> Definitely mistake on my part for not buffing the sword that time while merging. Why didn't I put this over here? 
Why am I like this? Okay. Much better. Alright, uh, we have a goobert here. We could make a goobert. Start that real early, couldn't we? Then just go ranged? I like that idea. Especially Fortunas. If we can manage that. Got a couple short bows. Turn you into a shield. Second banana is kind of feels important. So these things attack quickly, but have little damage. The steel goob short bow is good it is, especially since we're gonna get two of them. then. How do I want to handle this? The short bows are a little bit, gonna be a little bit rough to get working here, I think. Either way, I certainly change this a lot. Another short bow. I can kind of sort of afford it, can't I? Song Fortune is questionable. It is questionable. Like, I don't know what else to do with it. Like, make a tusk bow. Eventually switch out to a uh, non tusk bow, I guess. I did this backwards. It's supposed to be the other way around. It's supposed to be rotated. Like this. There we go. It's like we get tiny bows. You can get poison, luck, and tusk. And they're all kind of not great. But going for the big ones, we don't have access to it. I, guess, I mean, I could swap them. I'll probably end up swapping them out later. The shield not taking, the shield not activating anything, not activating goob because they're not taking hits because it's all ranged is a little painful here. Ooh, another goob. How much goob is too much goob? That's asking the real questions. I kind of want to go for a lot of goob. Because I 
can. No such thing as too much goob, I know, right? Alright, let's save for picking up these items later. Okay. Unless one make ultimate goob. I think probably the most consistent way to get ultimate goob I've seen is using the present to sell everything and just get goob that way. What is this shop? Can't do this to me, shop. Like We don't have much in the way of luck, so we're not getting a lot of crits out of this. I need space. I can't. I can't. Uh, magic shield is here. It's just a whole magic shield. Alright, fine. One acorn is fine. Give me space. Blueberries! Space counts. Alright. I can't, I can't do anything with this. Okay. Uh, the only thing he can trigger my still goob with here is the uh, knife at the dagger, which he's actually almost doing. <laughs> Uh. <laughs> Game just has to chill you like, yeah, giving me all the items and none of the space to deal with it. It's painful. Alright, uh, do we want to go Hunter this time? Oh, it's on sale. We gotta take the sale one, yeah? Give me... Okay. Can I just, do, do I just not run shield this time? Like, is that, is that, do I leave the Mega Clover in the box? Like, I, I literally, I can't place anything on the board because I don't have space to do so. Okay, we take Goob out. We merge this. <sighs> Put you here. This does nothing. We live with it. What do? That is so many gems. And deer wood. Okay. Alright. Good news is shield is getting us... Steel goop is starting to get some activations here. Still not enough. Alright. Slightly buffed short bows. Okay. Not nearly enough. Why oh, you never ultimate goop? 
No, I don't think... This has nothing to do with me having another goop. This is... I'm just literally never... I, I have not yet seen space added in the shop. You can predict when. <laughs> I appreciate the vote of confidence. All right. A little more HP. Space, please. Thank you. I don't really want... Alright, I need way better activators than this. Which I need space to do that. But I think I could do this. Put you here. That counts as an activator. There we go. Roll for space. Roll for space. Okay. That is so many shovels. Why are you like this? Yeah. Run a little low on time, sweet Jesus. is beautiful. Um... Could keep us alive. Which I can't currently afford. I mean, third bow is an activator. Yes! Or something of that sort. Maybe she digs you, ayo. Well, at least now I have some space to work with, yeah. Whatever that's worth. Start with plus two. No, you start with plus one. Okay. Uh, I think this one's just a mulligan. Serving things you're rolling is reducing the mass. Yes, all one thing I have reserved. Though I have uh, recently found space. So it's not an issue. I just had to roll past all the things I needed in order to find the space. We find backpack battles on Steam. What is our DPS like? It's like it's it's pretty it's pretty bad. All right, uh, now I can get this guy going. I'm gonna stay in the game here. Stam sack. Get back here. Bananas become activators? They can, yes. Which I should have done with this banana, actually, now that I put this here. Yeah, it's too late. Uh... I think we had a little bit rough of a start there, rolling past so many things that I couldn't pick up due to no space. So we'll try this again. 
Uh, pan, whetstone, just always a good start. Pig, pig strong. Bow? Another sword? We don't have stamina. We don't have banana. Pick up shield instead. Pick up sword. Double sword. We're not going to have stamina for this, but it might be okay. <clears throat> oh god, the shield. He started with his shield. He's such a strong start. Yeah. Tried so hard. Alright, uh, Tusk. Tusk. Roll. Whetstone. Sell. Luck. For whetstone? Question mark. Get a hero sword. He's been out of here too. Probably should have gone with banana instead of the whetstone, but it'll be fine, I think. <laughs> Crossblades at seven number two. Probably not. Um, probably not. All right. Tend to pick up an healing herb just to help carry us through. I'm gonna do that. There's a Goobert. Wouldn't mind some scaling here. Man's going cards. You don't see that every day. That's one thing I haven't done. Almost yet. Cards. Alrighty, uh, I'm gonna reserve this. I'm gonna grab this. And. Start it. Second banana with too many banana. You're, you're correct. I probably. I should have grabbed second banana. The second banana is where things actually need to like, stabilize. So I could have min max by bringing Blueberry over to this side. Nice. Alright, Steel Goobert is going to go great for us. Um, so, Wooden Sword, kind of sort of okay here. have any starting luck, but that will change eventually. I want to reserve that. I'm not interested in reserving that. Almost messed this up again.
Okay. About as good as we're going to get, I think. Okay. Is this similar to Backpack Hero? Uh, not really, no. I mean, it's... it's Kind of, but no. Um, this is more like Super Auto Pets, but Backpack Hero themed. No, I've been stunned. But our sword has been empowered. It stuns so much. Hey, we did it! All right, another Goobert. We could try for Super Goobert, but I'm gonna pass on that. Short bow. Meh. I definitely should have something here. Just to increase our damage output a little bit. There's a blueberry. Got some ripsaw action going there. Hmm. Stealing my hearts and my thorns. This is not going to end well for me. Yeah, no. It was close, though. Oh, extra blueberry. Don't mind if I do. Blueberry, blueberry. Whetstone, I'll take it, but I don't expect to be keeping it. Let's see. Carrot wouldn't be a bad thing here, would it? It wouldn't be an amazing thing either. I'll just jump into the next one. Um, if I can get... Nope. Let's do this. There we go. Let's do it. More food, the better. Uh, yeah, totally. None of them on sale. I tried Lifemind this time. Yes, give mana. Mana and healing. For the moment, at least. I need this here for Goob. More important. Another goob. That's a third goob. Blood goob. We're not really going melee here, are we? Um. Uh. There's a mana orb here. 
there's good options. I think what I'm going to do this time is here, 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 save this and grab this and just let it go. Okay. Use one weapon activator on Goob. Thinking about it. Really thinking about it. Red berries. Yeah, weapon activators are generally better than berries, but notably so. These weapon activators tend to be like 1.5 seconds, whereas berries are 2.5. Okay. Like here's 1.4, here's 1.7. My question is, do I want gloves? Because gloves is just speed. Speed is key. I think the answer is yes-ish. inconveniently placed, isn't it? Alright, do this. Do this. Okay. That'll do. And just food for now. For nature items. Okay. I think I'm okay on stamina. Falcon Blade Steel Goob. That would be good, yes. Falcon Blade is an activator. Bow for a uh, damage dealer. We're getting crit something fierce. Dark Saber, Taurus, all the way asunder. Okay, so this is where things get interesting. I definitely need the damage output here, which means we need to adjust a lot of this stuff. We can even go for tunas with this. Every time this thing hits, we get damage. Which is nice. Way better mana gen. Definitely need to slide this over one. That's not going to happen right now. Let's see. 0 0.5, 0 0.5. So we're about maxed on stamina. I can still do this. Second banana would be great. So I need space. I need space. Um... It is in the ranger bag. Hmm. Thinking about putting the acorn over here. If I put it over here, then it applies to this as well. as opposed to just this. But it gets less mana. It's not the best by a long shot. This is probably better over here, just on these two. No, it's not. Okay. 
we'll let it go. here that's better all right i'm okay with this rearrange okay. food i'll do that later looks like we are slowly draining mana very slowly yeah. worth it wow, 0 0.6 mana uh stamina uh, how much luck do we end up with? All right, so we, we're generating a lot of mana now. Uh, a little bit much. Wolf Pertanger is here to play. We're purchasing this to get it off the rack. Grabbing you, sweet Jesus, is beautiful. Mm, yeah, there you go. Another one of you for more luck generation. I can get another clover, that would be great. Ooh, hello. Yeah, they're cracking, welcome in. I'm gonna have mana, I'm gonna have luck. I don't have shield gen. Well, I'm going to have shield gen with steel beaver. All I need is thorns, which shouldn't be too big a deal. So actually, I could probably get this and get a very quick lamp. Throw it on. I guess bow and arrow is not the best case for it, but imagine getting it on falcon blade. Oof. Oh, here we go. There's a falcon blade. And we'll swap that to be an activator over here. I would like to have a shield. Maybe even holy armor. This will be a combined turn. children yeah but it only goes up to three thorns and you have to it has to trigger which is not you know great it's, it's not a good source but it is something it helps <clears throat> what am i looking at thorns and poison question mark got the chain whip Wow, that was close. Okay. I would love to get a Fortuna in here. All right, so now we want to change this up. We definitely want this as an activator. Uh, so it needs to be an activator on this side, I think. This thing attacks twice. Adam's trigger faster. We are gonna be running a little low on stam for this. Question is, do I want the gin lamp now or do I want, I think I can take it now probably. And I probably wanna put it on a falcon blade because it's gonna hit the quickest out of the whole group. So we want this here, ish, like so. I'm wondering if this short bow is going to cause problems for us. Um, I think for the moment I don't worry about I grief. The leaf. 
in exchange for the shields. It's probably the right answer here. Just so I can get the lamp going. So this will trigger 30% faster. This will be swinging real quick. I would like to get a bag on the lamp as well for whatever that's worth. Get it up to 40%. They'll be scaling this very quickly. Alright then. Blurberry. Weapons. Honestly, I wonder if just the mana warb on this alone is going to be enough. <laughs> this thing's going to be swinging pretty quick. Crits, I guess I'll leave it here. Unless, unless we do this. Like so. Let's bring it down one more. There we go. Just so it has the chance to crit. Extra chance to crit. Now we'll do this over here. Just as much mana as I can, I suppose. Hmm. So that should get up to plus 7 damage. This should be making Steel Goobert go off pretty quickly. We have this going as well. Shield of Valor would be a great replacement for Spike Shield, I think. And... That's probably about it. For the moment. Tripo is a goob activator. I don't know. It's 1.7 seconds. This is 3.5. I think I'd prefer the extra starting mana. So I can start generating luck faster, which helps everything else. And take mana leave. This is not going to help me. at all. Ooh, so much sun armor. Yeah, 
Yeah, I am having stamina issues. Not crazy. 60! Alright, I think... Yeah, Falcon Blade got buffed by the gin lamp somewhere along the way. You could tell, because it started dealing a lot of damage. Alright, so let's take a look at this what happened here. <clears throat> Falcon Blade hits. They hit me. Shortbow hits. Shortbow starts scaling in damage. Yeah. Hawking Blade keeps hitting, which scales a short bow. And up to five DPS, 5.5 DPS a piece. Slowly scaling upwards. Falcon Blade getting more damage due to just general crit. We have gained enough luck that it's it's starting to crit. It's jumping in damage. Our spikes are doing non-insignificant things. For the record, our spikes are doing about as much as the short bow, as the uh, long bow is. Uh, that's not true. Long bow just crit for lots of damage. And, uh... Let's see, where it is? Falcon Blade is up to 10 DPS. Uh, let's see. Where does that... You know, Falcon Blade is just critting ridiculously. Did we spend our thorns? We did spend our thorns. That's what happened here. Alright. Gained thorns here. And then Goobert activates, which immediately activates the Gin Lamp. Causing Falcon Blade to go crazy. Which is what we expected, but it's, it's only up to 18 DPS, which is not all that much. Pass lamp activation. I did indeed pass lamp activation. Alright, I would like to have this. But this is probably I think we're gonna unreserve this. I don't think I can afford I can handle that right now. Another acorn here. Acorn will help with crits. Another short bow. I need stamina. This is space. The vampirism... I don't know. I don't think we need another acorn color right now. Stamina pot. I'll grab. You do not combine with my bananas. More space here. A little expensive. This can help us get our lamp off quicker. So I'll pick it up. Next turn. Vampire Great Blade. It's two vamp though, which is not much vamp. But like, yes. It's not like, oh no, five vamp. Again, it does attack twice. It would be non-insignificant. Feels spreading thin. I mentioned that I don't like spending seven on this thing. get this where I need it to be. Yeah, 
Yeah, I've been convinced. Blood Amulet, I think, would be good. Powers might be your favorite class. Understandable. Can I fit Pig in here somewhere? Not really. I thought substantial rearrangement. No, given the amount of stamina issues we were having, I should probably just remove Shortbow, right? Like, Shortbow is really not doing anything, and it's taking up stamina. Alright, we'll just go for now. Come back later. I'm gonna check on Shortbow stats. Whoa! That was close. Yeah, Shortbow's not doing anything. By comparison. Alright, so we can take Shortbow out. Bring you in. Falcon Blade with Gin Lamp is just kind of our thing and only. More space. I would like to get another gin lamp on this, and if we do that, then I pretty much stop all of this and just go straight into double insta lamp. Short bow's activator. Yeah, actually, it's gonna be better than. I mean, it's 1.7 versus this, which is 3.5. So it's going to be a little bit more efficient. It means we're going to need more thorns. Steel Goob gives enough armor for both. We'll have enough mana, probably, for both. Luck. Not sure about actually. We'll get it quickly. Okay. Can Lance not activate more than once? Nope. One time on that. But you can multi lamp. Man's trying to get goob, but he's not gonna make it, I don't think. Not this deep. That can't just not be. No, it says. Wait a minute. It used to say once only, which is interesting. It's no longer once only. All right, second one. Uh, all right, so... Shield of Valor. It's just better than the Spike Shield. And I think we do alternate... solution i think we get rid of i think we get rid of the spike shield for the shield of valor and find alternate solutions to the uh to this i can get a moon shield to help with mana generation
I would still like to find a second clover for Fortunez. Here's another pineapple. I'm getting over that. Actually, if I sell this and this, I can get this this turn, which doesn't help me, does it? Okay. Uh, let's slow this down a little bit and watch the log here. Because I need luck, I need thorns, I need armor. Armor will get. And there goes one of them. We ramp up Falcon Blade. Man's got so many daggers just shanking me with. Hit me with some pretty fierce poison, too. Holy smokes. So that was close. Um, the double shield of Valor. 35% uh, chance multiple times with corrupted crystals on it keeping me out of the whole dealing damage thing see bow and arrow here bow and arrow is outpacing falcon blade even after even after uh gin lamp which is terrifying It took a while for Falcon Blade to compete. Even at the end, Bow and Arrow, yeah, even at the end, Bow and Arrow was outpaced, it was higher DPS. Oops, sorry, Moving Thorns? Yes, actually, that, that makes sense. So I didn't notice the Ripsaw. That explains a lot, actually. Okay. Well, that was close. Hello there, Icicle. How are you doing today? Okay, so this should help us against ranged and then also give us some mana. Uh, oh, actually, it's also gonna buff, it's gonna buff Steel Goober to give him some more, regenerate more armor per armor now. All right, so we toss you here and I don't know, get this guy here. Tired? Understandable. It is it is a sleepy time now, isn't it? Here is another glove of haste. Another 20%. I don't think I can fit here without causing problems. Um I'd like space over here. another lamp which will not be producing which will not be activating this but I could get it just to produce just to produce some thorns every two seconds might be a good idea 5% faster go full speed ahead One of these days we'll find enough lucky clovers for Fortuna, but today is not that day. Alright. Can Lamp activate the bow? 
Uh, you can activate lamp on the bow if that's what you're asking about. What is hitting me? I don't know what hit me, but it did a lot of damage. Frostbite. Fro Frostbite just started with incredible DPS. What gave it the DPS? Book? Crit? Was it just the crit damage? Is that no, it's it's damage is actually at is actually just at twenty nine. Why what? What am I missing here? Chat, what am I missing here? Why is this at twenty nine damage? Alright, log. And frostbite hit for twelve. Okay. I hit for 20. Yeah, it hit for 12, and then it hit for 20. And then hit for another 18. Just keeps hitting for 55 crit. I. Why is it critting for so much? It's gaining damage. And I don't see how. I don't see anything that gives it damage. It's just gaining damage. Okay, I see what it is. No, it's this here. The more cold I have afflicted, the more damage it deals. Okay, that's a unique interaction with the frozen flame and the frostbite here. Okay, that, that makes sense. Oh look, another clover. We can make the Fortuna's Grace. That'd be nice. I think I just put this anywhere. Just to produce thorns, please. And... Plus one damage. You can do it. That's all she wrote. Okay, so last round. Let's do this. Oh, we've got a backpack full of dolls. a lot of damage. I like seeing it hit very, very quickly, very hard. Alright, well there's a Falcon Blade victory. It starts off low DPS and then scales up very rapidly. Yeah, real rapidly. So how quick are we getting our first lamp? It's not really an insta lamp. It's. Oh god, Mrs. Struggles. 
just devouring all of our buffs. There's a lot of buff removal. Honestly, with the amount of thorns removal in the game right now, I feel like this is... Unless you can literally do an insta-lamp, it's probably not worth it. And all slowed a lot? Yeah, they did. Because I don't have... I don't literally have an insta-lamp. It's just rapid lamp. And that's that's a problem. Because we go from being okay to having all of our stuff removed and this removes one two three four five six seven eight nine ten removes ten buffs which is kind of intense we get the mana back quickly um, and with the mana comes the luck but then oh god we lose so much of it here Time to go paintballing. Ayo. Have a good one out there, Kane. Good luck out there. Look at it. And then we just kind of crit with the Falcon Blade for, you know, a lot. We do actually get close to uh, close to pulling out the second lamp. Like we're we're one away, and it gets our buffs get knocked off again. Look at this. We needed one more thorns. One more thorns would have done it. But um, we just kind of slashed him with the falcon blade and, you know, took him out. Which did it. Uh, with all damage to me, fatigue? I mean, yeah, I was. we were taking fatigue damage, yes. Interestingly enough, they were taking way more fatigue damage than we were. Or we were taking way more da fatigue damage than they were. They have something that increases my fatigue. Yeah, yeah, okay. Mr. Struggles over here increasing my fatigue. So I was actually taking a lot of fatigue damage. They did... Almost all of their damage they dealt to me was actually fatigue damage. This fatigue slowly ramps up over time. And then once we get into the actual fatigue start... It, um, it starts ramping up very quickly. Like here, it's only done 80 damage, which is, you know, about 5 DPS. And then suddenly it rapidly increases. 8, 9, 10, 12. By the time it gets to the end, it had dealt, they had dealt 276 fatigue damage. Neat. Victory! You love to see it. Want your power again? Don't mind if I grab this instantly. Try the dragon, the dragon nest. Do it. Stab him to sleep. Yes. 
Hello. That was easy. Yeah, I'll just grab a full price shield next round. Do I want to go with fire daggers? I don't think so. I like torch. Burning sword's pretty okay. What do you guys think? I'm not going to go Torch this time, we did Torch last time. I'm going to try Dragons this time. Oh, they're digging my face. Oh, it hurts so much. You can't do this to me. We're not near. As much as I want it, we're not near. But it removes thorns. We're not near. We're gonna sell as a burning blade. Drag Goobert into the fray this time around. Let's go. <laughs> Some dragons are more equal than others. I am not surprised by this whatsoever. Fatigue sets in. Kind of surprised we're not in the lead here. Legit win. I guess we're a villain sword build now. Um, okay. <clears throat> uh, well, a second time in a single day, we've seen villain sword. So, it's a sign. We're picking it up. Question is, what are we getting rid of for it? Uh, so we pick this up, and I guess I don't really need this much anymore. Well, I'll take it. That probably means I want to get away from Burning Sword eventually. But for the moment, we'll keep it. Okay. Now all daggers? Yep, all daggers. All daggers all day. What subclass am I going to pick with this? I don't even know. Like, friendly fire? Like, I guess heat goes pretty well. I guess I guess dark lantern would probably go pretty well, too. Not that I can mix it with this. Um, do I want fire daggers? Probably not.
It goes from two to five to three to seven. So it goes one to five. It's probably not worth it. I mean, it may be. It may be because of this speed. I just, I don't know what to do from here. Burning Sword is Lahitra. Yeah, Burning Sword is fine. Um, but... The, um... My concern is that as the heat gen goes up, we're not going to increase our stamina. And I don't really want to lose the heat that way. Um, heat gen from Chili Pepper and Chili Goober is probably going to be the way to go. Um, we may have a reasonable opportunity to get the, the burning sword, long sword here. Burning blade, because that's just guaranteed heat gen. It's every hit. It is zero, it is, it does cost stamina. But we want daggers here. Space. More goob. Why do I not have goob over here? I'm doing this. Okay. Banana scales with the banana does, yes. The bananas are not uh, as effective as the base stamina regen. So we need more stamina items. I think you need stamina items, not just base stamina regen. Base stamina regen at 1 per second is better than the 1, point, one per 5 seconds of a uh, banana. There's another dagger. It's instant pickup. Andromeda. Would Pepper next to Goobert help? You have no idea what to do. A Pepper next to Goobert is a good idea. Yes. Why not make Chili Goobert? Um, at the moment, I don't care for heat that much. It's not. I'm stamina locked, so it doesn't really help me. Um, Alright. What do I do here? Is this just a Crusader pick? Holy item activates 30% chance to inflict. Remove two buffs from your opponent and gain. It's like, this is, Crusader's probably got the best passive aside from maybe Dark Lantern. So this is either, this is either a Ashbringer pick or a Crusader pick. I doubt I'm going to be getting enough. Yes, I'm not going into mana gen here. Alright, Crusader or Ashbringer? I think I think we actually do Crusader here. All right. Just keep our buffs fine. Keep our buffs alive. Remove buffs from the opponent. Gain regen for ourselves. I think I think this is what we do. Weird pick, but I'm okay with this. Alright, so a few things. We want you, we want... You can get all of it. Uh, and... Banana. Go 
here, you go here, and this is for every holy item, of which we have none currently. Sweet, go. Giving us some health regen, which is nice. God, it's... It's just getting carried so hard by the villain sword. I mean, it's already at 10 DPS. <laughs> Can you imagine? No. We're going to need all the space in the world for this. Okay. There's a ruby egg, but we're not going dragons this time. Which I wanted to initially. Um, yeah, second banana. Second banana too strong. Is it time to... I think it's time to make... To make Goobert. Upgrade Goobert here. Heroic potion, however. Uh, no. We need knives. I think Demonic Orb is actually not going to be that great for us here, because the daggers are going to absorb all of those crits, and they're just going to do nothing. Hmm. I think, I think we just let this one go. Remove thorns on Draconic Orb. It's expensive though, and daggers, blades, we need more blades. Dagger into thorns is bad, that's true. That is true. Yes, steal their buffs. Turn them into regen, although they are draining my regen slowly. Nice. Another dagger. Alright. You can go here, you... Uh, take all of my gold to do that, but that's fine. Reserve dagger for next time. Double torch. That is a whole lot of that is a whole lot of coal in one place. A man sitting on four coal right now. Another dagger. Um What can I do here? I am going to need space and a lot of it. Here's our holy armor. We'll save then for holy armor. Um, I'm going to need so much space. You need like all the space. dying. Wow. Alright, what did he hit me with? A lot of little things. A lot of whelps. A lot of whelps. Many whelps. Not handled. Alrighty then. Uh, so how do I get sun armor in here? Just... Boop. How do I get banana back in here? Over here. Over here. I need... Two of these now. So I 
think what I do is this here, this here, and we get sun armor going. Sun armor will help us. It'll drain some of our. Uh, it'll drain some of our heat, but we do have notable heat generation. I'm gonna shift things around next round. Okay. Drop shield. I don't think this is a drop shield angle. It's not yet. Um, is this? Does this person know t item activation order? They don't. Hey. Makes our life so much easier. All right. Okay, so now we got a few good things. That's a holy item activates 30% chance to inflict blind for five seconds, which means you can go back here. And you are not going to be surrounded by fire items, which is unfortunate, but it is the world we live in. I need so much more space is what I need. Counts. Another dagger. <sighs> okay, so I need to slide things around a little bit here. More damage, more good. To me, this reads that I want to have this underneath here. Which I might be able to do, actually. If I do this. Then need this nearby. This needs to be nearby both. How can I facilitate that? That'll do it. This needs to slide down one, among other things, but that can happen later. Another Draconic Orb. Another Banana.
Okay. Ah. It's hitting me pretty hard here. The blind is pretty nice. Okay, yeah, well, you know, it critting for 64. Pretty good. Need this over here. Too many good things, not enough space, not enough ways to put it. There is a shield of valor, which would be lovely to have. Um, drop shield through rabbit. I would like, I would prefer to get a shield of valor here, I think. Unlock this. Okay. I don't think I want more than this. Because while... I guess I could spam. Well, if I, if I get a fire shield, this also counts. Which would just, every time he hits me, he's got a 30% chance of... No, a 35% chance of 30% chance. Which could be devastating. He missed a lot for a dude who didn't have many stacks of blind on him. Alright. So we'll do this. And fire. We'll do this first. It's too much. This, however, I, I need. So we can upgrade this guy. No longer need this. That's not happening. What else? What else? Can I even get a second Draconic Orb in here? I don't, I don't know that I can. Not without rotating this guy to the side. tough one, isn't it? I could slide this up, lose a goober trigger, but I would get this guy, which is probably better off on all honesty, because I'm not relying heavily on heat here. Um, do I want to... I think I want to try this now. Uh, which means redesigning this substantially. Uh, so we'll be, I'm going to describe it as sacking around for the purposes of, uh, uh, purposes of getting more. No, oh, sacking around is a little strong of a word. Did I leave an orb in the backpack? I left the orb in the backpack. That's a mistake. Ah, well, it doesn't really matter. They're not super valuable for me. I have a lot of blind on me. I don't have a whole lot of cleanse, either. Because I'm at 90... I'm at 100% miss rate right now. Which is kind of a lot. Uh, however, I... Yeah, 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 that's death. Okay. I don't have cleanse. Okay. Now we can reorder this. Um, so this gives me <coughs> damage and... Um, holy. Do I slide you down one?
If I do this, then I can get this guy here and this guy here. That's much better. Okay, all right, now we're talking. Let's see, 1.6 seconds, 1.3 seconds, it doesn't, doesn't really matter. Alrighty then, um, another lump of coal, Wolpertinger, Wolpertinger? Wolpertinger's good just in, in general on Pyro. I need space for things and stuff. Don't need more of this. Don't need more of that. This will come in handy for next round will pertain. Alright, great. So we've got several flavors of blinding activity going on here. Uh, this is counting. And then just flame. Flame on. What we're doing next round. Alrighty. This is working wonders for us. They healed quite a lot and went invulnerable, and we're kind of just crunching through. Oh god, the axe hit so much! Woo! Alright, Wolper Tinger goes on here. Do we not have more. I desire more knives, the little shanky ones. I think I don't want more of this because I can't get it next to the armor anymore. Which is fine. And I just, I don't need to worry about anything else. So we are all good here. Wilbur Tinger doesn't need to be here specifically. I need to take this guy and shift it like all the way over. Oh man, I guess it's not the worst thing to have it next to Goobert, but I need another knife here. And... If I do this instead, I get more space, don't I? I do. Kind of. I need at least one more dagger. Ideally, two more daggers. Okay. Engine build of holy molten daggers applying blind. <laughs> uh, you know, that would probably work reasonably well, especially if you have a hammer. What? That's a whole heap load of burst damage. Holy smokes. We got bloody daggers. Poison daggers. A lot of bonus damage added on crit. So these are crit daggers. This is just a hammer dagger build with disgusting amount of crit to begin with. That's that's what this is. It worked. Yeah, that worked wonders. I just didn't get an opportunity to actually get those to get hits in. He just hit disgustingly hard, very quickly. All right. Space. We'll be moving that later. I need dagger. Space. Moving that later. I need dagger. None of these things are dagger. <clears throat> Is it worth me bringing out Gloves of Haste as attack 20% faster with this? Right now, probably in lieu of a dagger. I 
like I didn't have stamina issues. So we should be good to go. This game looks like a YouTube scam ad. Oh no, it kind of does. Just the uh, artistic style. That man's crown saved him so much damage. It's uh, not about to not save him much anymore. We are, we are actually hurting for stamina pretty hard, really. But cleared. Well, that's a dagger run. I didn't expect to see a dagger. The uh, dagger of darkness, as it were. Uh, that, that was a good time all around. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's been a great stream. Looking forward to doing some more. So make sure to hit that subscribe button. Make sure to hit that follow button because we got more content like this going out multiple times a week, every single week. Remember, the best place to get in contact and to generally join the community and interact is on the Discord link in the description below. Uh, but that's gonna be it for me tonight. Had a great time all around, and I uh, look forward to seeing you guys next time for some more backpack. So for now, have a good night, everyone. I'll see you guys later. <laughs>